Welcome back to Antigua Barbuda Today. And joining us this morning, we have Altino Spencer, who is the mixologist. As you can see, we have all these lovely things here. This is my favorite section, drinks, anything <laughs> with drinks. A little bit of alcohol? Just a little bit. All right, then. And we also have Miss Ebony Edwards, and she is the chairperson of the mixology competition committee. So they are here to tell us about the competition that has been taking place and what's the next step going forward. Yes. Ms. So, Edwards? Tania, thank you so much for having us. Good morning, everybody. So on December 9th at the Sir Vivian Richards Cricket Stadium, we will be hosting the season finale for the mixology competition. So initially, we had about 15 persons that signed up to enter into the competition, and we selected our top eight. And now we're down to our top three. So we have Miss Altino Spencer. The other two couldn't join us today, so Altino decided to come along with me and make something nice for you. I, I love that. Right. I love that. So I, we need I everybody dreams. to come out on December 9th to see if Altino is going to win, or if Colton King, representing Love Life Foundation, will win, or if Canto George, representing Jumbi Bay, will win. Oh, Canto will be held in the well right, right, in stiff the competition. Stand. Altino, very it's, stiff competition. It's going to be. <laughs> Kanto is my usual drinks person. Oh so boy. Now you're going to have to try to outdo that, you know. So listen, give me something good today. Okay. So you, you got oh. me sorted out. I got you sorted out. Tell us okay. what you're making us <laughs> since making, we're, making for us today. Since we're going into the Christmas season, yes. I decided to do something totally different. I'm doing a song, uh, Sorrel Sangria. Nice. Yeah. Okay. Sorrel and hibiscus to be exact. Ooh. Yeah, I made okay. some hibiscus syrup to add with this. And it's basically my favorite term, perfection in a glass. So let the fun begin. Tell, tell us what you're putting in. So I'm starting with some red wine. Um, usually when we do sangria, we do a big batch. So we'll say three cups of red wine. Four. OK, four. <laughs> <laughs> uh, preferably a dry red wine. OK. Um, some people uh, you know, use orange juice, but I prefer to use an orange-based liqueur, which is Cointreau. For this, I'll add two ounces. Alcohol again. Oh, yes. <laughs> That's why it's so fun. Ooh. And then, you know, oh, stick it out. Local Ooh. rum. English, English Arbor. Arbor. English Arbor. Three ounces. Four. <laughs> you have to add a little extra of everything. It's Christmas. Exactly, it's Christmas. <laughs> yeah, it's just a little giving. extra of everything. Okay, and this I made myself. It's a uh, cinnamon flavored simple syrup. You know, again, Christmas theme. Drop that in there. Yes, That'll so be three ounces. Nice. Oh, yeah. <laughs> and now the good, good, the sorrel. So it's a sorrel and hibiscus um, drink. You know, Christmas theme. Yeah, I forget it. Yeah, all. Just, just throw it in. Just, yeah, yeah. That would be six <laughs> ounces. Don't drown out the alcohol. No, never, never, <laughs> never, never, never. All right. And part of a uh, good sangria is the fruits. Okay, normally for a sangria, we'll do about eight between eight to 24 hours to get all the flavor into the fruits, mm. which is actually the best part. So any fruit you have laying around your house, you can actually add it to it. What fruits are you adding there I'm right adding now? right now apples, oranges, limes, and some pears. Okay, nice. Quality check. I'm glad He's I'm so up fancy. here and not Patrice, <laughs> so I actually get to taste it first. <laughs> Okay, <laughs> but if you like, you can add or subtract more alcohol if you want it sweeter, more sugar, but depending on your taste. Okay. Now, the good spices. Again, Christmassy. Put in some so more. all of this is because it's Christmas. Oh, this yeah. is not usually in a sangria. Um, yes, it is. Some people, well, the way I was, was raised, we actually had to have cinnamon. It kind of brings out the Christmas theme in you, you know? I'm gonna have to have a talk with Kanto because I never get all of these things in oh my brain. Oh boy. You know? <laughs> this is just starting to, the competition is looking stiff. <laughs> it's looking stiff already. You know, you know, I'm going to the road there, you know. <laughs> I'll miss saving the best man when. Okay. They're very fancy with their garnishes. Very. I can tell. Very important. <laughs> So, Ebony, in the meantime, um, could you tell us when the competition is going to be held? Okay, so on December 9th at the Sir Vivian Richards Cricket Stadium, the mixology competition will be happening in the party stand. However, we have other competitions taking place. Okay. So, once again, we do want to keep it local because it is under the theme, Taste of Wood Dadley. All right? 
and we will be having a fire pit competition. So we know by now, everybody knows Susie's hot sauce. Yes. But we do have other persons that have been entering the hot sauce market. Okay. So we do have another set of finalists. We have five finalists that will be competing for the top hot sauce spot. Okay. All right. So that happens at 12.30 p.m. also at the Cricket Stadium. And then there's other competitions, but those are for the general public. Tell us a little bit about those. So with that, you and your crew, five persons total, can win five free tickets to see Burner Boy ooh, live in concert. Ooh. Right. Patrice, so, <laughs> we're, we're on this. Right. So all you have to do, come on out on December 9th to the Suburban Richards Cricket Stadium. And for every $20 worth of chits that you purchase, because okay. we will be using a chit system. Okay. So for every $20 worth of chits that you purchase, you get entered into the draw to go and see Burner Boy awesome, with you and awesome. your crew. Right. Awesome. Also, another competition for the general public. All you need to do is show up on December 9th wearing at least three colors of the Antiguan flag, and you could win two free tickets round trip to the United States. Oh, nice. Yes, I hear Nice. <laughs> the studio the, went the, silent. Listen, this whole day is right up my alley. Burn a boy. Yes, so you can win Free trips boy. to New York. Listen, right, listen. Right? This is right up my alley. Drinks, hot sauce. So after you try all the spices and your tongue is burning and your eyes are watering, you can come on over to the party stand. Altino, Canto, or Colton will mm -hmm. serve you the winning drink. And Definitely. then you just model your Antiguan colors, win a trip to the States. All right, so I guess nice now easy. is it, I'm, I'm ready for the tasting segment. Call you. So Patrice, it, li listen, I, w I was going to call you, but I see you're getting up already. So there's an extra glass here for you. <laughs> so is, is there a name for this drink, Altino? It's just a sorrel and hibiscus sangria. So what do you call it? That's what I just call it, plain and simple. Straight to the point, sorrel, sangria. So, so a hibiscus <laughs> something, something like that. Hi, Gria. Hi, Gria. Hi, Gria. Oh, that, that, that is so good. That's so good. That's so good. Let's go. Come. All right. Okay. Okay. Cheers. Cheers. Let's see. Happy Cheers. holidays. Holidays, everybody. Happy holidays, people. <laughs> so on December 9th, we will see you ladies ooh. in the party stand. Ooh. Right? I, I, take, I there. taste the hibiscus. I, ooh. Mm-hmm. Okay. How you feel? Okay. Mike can take a little more. Oh, what do you want? What do you want? <laughs> yes, I got everything right now. Mike can take a little bit more spice. Sauce, yeah. sauce, you know, you know, those but this is awesome. This is can really take a little, good. We'll, we'll call it cinnamon for, for TV purposes. You will call it cinnamon for now. A little bit more. A little bit more. A flash of cinnamon. A yes, flash yeah. of spice. Look at it. Look at it. Look at yeah. Just a bit of spice. Right? right? No problem. Yes, right. I totally agree. This is a calling canto. Uh, mm, mm, mm. You're not calling Canto. Canto. But listen, listen. Canto, no, I, I'm here now. There's a, a mug here still. So Canto outside for now. Canto is going to have to come and make me special special drink oh himself. God. And I then like I can it. make okay. a better decision. Listen. Okay. Canto. Altino in the lead right now. Canto is looking a little bit Canto, rough. Canto, your competition <laughs> looking a little tight. A little stiff. Yes, what so time is Taste of Dudley starting on everything Friday? Everything kicks off at 11 a.m. Okay. And then, of course, we're closing off the night because it's food, cricket, entertainment, drinks, everything. So we will be closing off the night. And tickets to Burn Boy. And tickets to Burn Boy. Very important with part. With tea and winter. Ooh. Oh, the after party Ooh. section. Ivy Fire. You're going to have live um, pan playing. You're going to have dancers. We're going to have the Iron Band from Point. They're going to be facing off with the Pathfinders drum team oh, oh, as well. Nice, so nice. That, that's our version of a nice. song clash. Oh, okay. the Iron Band or <laughs> very nice, very nice. So you have that taking place. Then, of course, female power. We have the West Indies female yes. cricket team versus the England female cricket team as well. So a lot happening at the stadium on Friday. Starting at 11 a.m. All right. So guys, yes, uh, we had Ebony Edwards mm -hmm. and Altino Spencer, and they were telling us about the mixology competition coming up on December 9th. We're hoping to see everybody there. I'm going to be there. There's going to be lots of alcohol, lots of music, lots of entertainment. <laughs> yes. So we'll see you guys there. Coming up next, we have our live Christmas tree decoration. Okay. See the hat? This is what this is all about. <laughs> so stay with us. We'll be right back. 